struggle as a character is being in love with somebody who cannot see me, uh, doesn't know what I look like, and my fear is that they will not love me once they gain their eyesight. I say my goal as a character is being a sufficient guide and companion for Pablo. What are my struggles as a character? It's probably the fact that I'm blind. There are two girls that I am simultaneously in love with. One that I used to be in love with and told I was going to marry, and then the other one who I'm starting to fall in love with more and more every day. So besides for being blind, that's probably my other biggest struggle. What are my thoughts on Marianella? Well, she has this, I've never actually seen her, but she has this inner beauty. She has been my eyes for so many years because again, I'm blind and she's done so much for me, but at the same time, this other woman, my cousin, is really starting to grow on me, so I'm kind of confused there. Well, my goal is to get married because I look forward to the wealth in my family and I'm excited to find someone who shares the same. And I also want to help Marianella because poor woman, she really has nothing and I want her to be like me. I think my struggles as a character are figuring out how I can help Pablo be able to see the world now. I'm his cousin, I'm his go-to, like we're the one person and I just have to figure out how to be the same person with him. What do I think about Pablo? Um, Pablo, I think Pablo is an innocent, vulnerable character and he does not know exactly uh, what surrounds him in the world, what kind of society he's part of and I think that before gaining eye eyesight he's vulnerable to the agendas of his family, specifically his father, um, who wishes to marry him off to his cousin Florentina. And But besides for that, he's this innocent man with a love and compassion, and he wants to explore the world through anything that he can, and I think he does so through me. Wow. Well, I mean, I'd say, I don't, my character doesn't have much struggles, but I guess I'd say, uh, trying to successfully do my work without harming others negatively. I mean, my goals as a character are to try to heal uh, Pablo's sickness, make him see again, um, and yeah, that, that's mainly it. What do I think of Nella? Oh, poor woman. I just, I feel so terrible. You know, I walked into her house and she has nothing and I told her, come live with me. I'll have a bed for you, I'll have clothes for you. I mean, look at the clothes she wears. You know, I just, I feel so terrible. I wish, I really want to help her out. People should come see this play to see the beauty and to be lifted of their own blindness and be able to see both inner and outer beauty and learn how to appreciate both, but at the same time still appreciate your cousin more because she has more outer beauty. What's good about this play is that it's very powerful. You know, the story of Pablo and the love that we found and the sorrow of Nella is just so sad to watch. And I think people need to see it because you don't want to end up like her. You know, you want to see how you can help her. And I'm just so happy. Well, I think people should see the Spanish play because I'm going to make someone who's blind not blind. I mean, that's pretty, pretty awesome. You don't see that very often, so yeah, go and watch it. People should come to the Spanish play because we don't read a play like Marinella all of high school in any of our English classes or our uh, language classes, and it's an important message about beauty and insecurity, and there's a lot to gain from being part of the audience. And also, who doesn't love the Spanish play, you know? Everyone should come to the Spanish play.